Welcome to my store. Are you my friend? That's my friend, and he is extremely dangerous. Extremely dangerous, <laughs> yes, extremely. Yeah, I can tell you've seen some shit. Walked in here like it's a fucking tea party. Not a snitch, are you? Know anything about the eggs on Mount Chiliad? Labra! Right here, Jack Staves! Right here! This is my personal physician, Labrat. Wouldn't go anywhere without him. Labrat, this is our new friend, Fresh Meat. Doesn't seem to know much about the eggs on <laughs> Mount Chiliad. So what do you recommend we give as a first dose into the fucking truth, man? Me first, of course. Okay, well, as your physician, let's see, I recommend a baseline of cocaine. And then five big hits off of the pin. Only guy who can get a breakthrough DMT dose in a vape. And then some of the new phenethylamine. My assistant's been working on to get your oxytocin levels right. And we'll finish with a little something I like to call snake sweat. Half mescaline, half scopolamine. Now that'll take you the rest of the way! <laughs> yeah! Perfect. Dosage? Well, as your physician under the circumstances, I recommend... A lot! Exactly my thoughts. Uh, now the same for them. Ah, uh, shit, I gotta restock. Alright, walk with me. You know a guy by the name of Wade? Hey, he's in our troop. Really, really smart. He called me a few weeks back and told me the going was good here. And boy, was he right. It's got everything a human being needs to survive, from convenience stores to unregulated pharmacies, and nothing that we don't need. We're doing something big here. We gotta go. Chef is fucked up. This isn't some clinical trial, amigo. Your bro was balls deep into lab rat special sauce before we could say the frickin' B word. Okay, whatever, but we gotta go. These crazies, they started their own gang war with the lost. They stole a bunch of their bikes, their meth. It's not safe here. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> this is Luchadora. She runs our wrestling league. BDKD, bro. Welcome to the troop. Troop wrestling league? You're not gonna join these weirdos, are you? Hey, you strange little wiry man. Anyone can join the troop, okay? <sighs> this is insane. I gotta wake Chef up. I can see you're a bottom line kind of person, go. so here it is. We're new in town, but we've got a plan. I want every trust fund baby, pinstripe suit, middle manager, snapmatic influencer, and public servant stripped to the waist in the L.S. River, huffing whippets, shit in their pants, screaming at the top of their lungs that nothing fucking matters! But I'm good on! But I'm good on! But I'm good on! But I'm good on! It's those biker assholes, they're still in the RV! Fuckers, of course they are! Get out of the people out of here! On it! Move, move, move! Help us get out of this and we'll cut you into the deal. Fuck up these bikers and get my RV back in this low Santos time, baby! Whoa! Get over to the roof! Show me your butthole, fellas! I need a
They got some nutsack coming here. Fresh meat. If you can get me my RV back, I'm gonna say you're basically one of us. I checked the GPS. Looks like it's across the sea at Miller's Fishery. I'm gonna deal with some shit over here. You go get it. And before you ask, you're gonna get paid. We take care of the truth.
Here's our destination. Let's go! So, the Ombre Wade told us about this place in town. Some kind of abandoned warehouse. We're gonna make it our own, swat that shit, and turn it into something we're gonna call the Freak Shop. <laughs> That's where the troops gonna get everything done. Business and pleasure. You're loving it. fucked up or walking around with your junk out and yeah that's a big part of it but it's also about not giving a fuck given that you're willing to drive some lunatic you just met to some warehouse you don't know with a bunch of biker dudes up your ass trying to kill you i'd say you clearly do not give one single fuck <laughs> fresh beef you like that it's a hell of a name for a hell of a fool again the only name you're ever gonna need let's Go! Fuck your butthole! Reminds me of the time I did peyote in my cousin's cornfield. I just looked down all the rows and thought, wow, infinity. That's where we're going, friend. You just sit tight. Ready for my call, and then be ready for anything. 